Hey everybody, Tobias Ralph here at NAM 2012 at the Stoner Honor booth. Uh, it's an honor to be here. Stoner makes the best drums in the world. I'm very privileged to be a part of the team. Uh, I started playing drums. My dad was a musician. He was a classical pianist, uh, and he was very influential in helping me. I, I had a, a natural inkling for the drums, and he very um, sort of really encouraged it. Um, so I, my first influence was with Ringo Starr, um, and then I went to uh, Max Roach, and then from Max Roach it was like Tony Williams and Billy Cobham became the hugest, biggest influences to me. Um, and now today, um, obviously Vinny Colaiuta, um, Marco Miniman, and uh, I could go on. Lots, lots of incredible players out there who are just every every person I see is sort of gives me something to think about and try and work on, you know, so it's sort of a, a vast variety, you know, so. I discovered Sonar Drums uh, really when I, I started uh, doing some gigs over in Germany with uh, with a German pop star named Nana, um, and they provided me with a set, and uh, I love the sound of them, and they tuned up easily. Uh, a lot of the Sonar Drums have this really nice low end, uh, and like I put any head on them, and they just, they tune up perfectly um, and uh, so I've been part of the family ever since and it's it's it's, been, it's a great great family to be part of so uh, we're excited because they'll be doing some clinics with us in the upcoming year uh, could you also talk a little bit about your DVD that's, that's about to come out yeah. uh, DVD coming out uh, it's uh, put out by a company called uh, ACM uh, entertainment or um, ACM interactive company and it's run by a uh, person named Brian Brodeur um, it's a great videographer, uh, and the DVD should be coming out in a couple of months. And we have a couple of promo copies here, and uh, covers a lot of different things, um, and sort of sort of shows my influences of, of starting when I got really interested in playing techno music and drum and bass music, and how those elements sort of have come into play in other facets of, of, of my playing, so uh, soloing and groove playing. Who are some of the artists that you're touring with regularly where people might be able to see you live? Um, um, I've been touring regularly with Adrian Ballou's Power Trio. Um, I was on the road for a long time with Tricky. Um, so uh, Adrian will probably have some more dates coming up. I think probably in the spring. Uh, we go to Mexico City next week. Um, so that's probably where you'll be able to see me on tour. I don't know. So hopefully there'll be more stuff coming up.